자, 뉴욕 타임즈가 잔뜩 쌓였는데 미국발 미국에 관한 기사만 골라서 이번은 한번 미국에 관한 기사만 한번 읽어보겠습니다. 어? This is the best time for something big. She knows how to get out. Of dancers, what she needs incredibly fast while making them excited about the process. This is the best time for something big. The choreographer Amy feels now is the moment that I'm coming into my own. A slew of work compounds that. U.S. China student exchanges under threat. Scholarly co uh, collaboration at all levels have been eroded by the geopolitical tension. But the reduction in student exchanges could be especially harmful to the future of understanding between the two countries," said Dennis, the former executive vice chancellor of Duke Kunsan University, a partnership between Duke University in North Carolina and the Yuhan University in Eastern China. New homes suitable for threatened redwoods. As the earth warms, some volunteers are participating in assisted migration, relocating trees to more hospitable areas. It's not like it's going to escape and become a nu nuisance species. The tree and its kindred, each one gnarled and scarred from the fires, storms, and droughts, it had survived over thousands of years, towered over the other tree species in the forest. We told ourselves we were in control, but some things are just more powerful than people. My sins tend to be more uh, metaphysical than political. A lot of political fiction begins with its own answer. When Paul Lynch started writing his novel, Prophet Song, he worried it might destroy his career. The story an unsettling dystopian parable was just stylistically daring, relentlessly dark, and more emotionally taxing than anything he'd attempted before. He thought it would never get publicized, but when he sat down in his Dublin home and typed out the novel's opening passages, he couldn't stop.
her Pimlan Sawpist, she also dazzled her clients with deco. Mika. Erectigan. Her death was announced by a friend, Linda. Mika, the New York Doheny of interior design, who fled from communism in post-war Romania, ran a chicken farm in Canada, married the legend of American pop music, and for 50 years dazzled her clients with stylish deco, died on Saturday morning at a home in Southampton, New York, on Long Island. She was 97. <sighs> Love letter to a season I never loved when I was the young. Darkness falls early now, but I don't fight it. Impossible to say, but every spring these uh, finches nested uh, communally in my late neighbor's arboviti, where I can see them from my writing table. Here I know them even by the stems, and the seed has uh, they leave behind when winter comes. At home, the wrens who nested in our clothes pin back last summer have returned to roost uh, in their old nest on this cold night. I tiptoe, tiptoe. When I, when I take the dog out after dark, for I don't want to flush the tiny bird from their safe the roost into a cold darkness uh, where owls are uh, the waiting. As soon as uh, my husband changes the Christmas dress, the house of uh, the uh, finches arrive to investigate. Are they looking for food, for potential roosting spot, planning ahead for a uh, nesting season? Impossible to say, but every spring, these finches nested communally in my late neighbor's arbor vitae, where I can see them from my writing table. <clears throat> For a memorable party, personal large the punch. If an alcoholic root root <laughs> is the preferred guest can mix the same ounce of base with their chosen spirit along with the bitters, soda water, and the sparkling wine. Broadway babies charm an older audience. Young theater actors 
stage of performance for seniors and delighting the result. You have to audition and audition and audition until you get a you get a part. She said, so it was good for me to see all these young kids who have been fortunate to get to star when they are so young. For the children, the concert was an opportunity to connect with an older generation through a shared passion. They let us witness the moment when marbling and pondering became the most natural things to do in front of a certain object. Include the children in your workout. Usage with active parents are more likely to be active themselves, research says. Make use of the playground. A playground can be a great place to get, uh, to get in a full body workout. Mr. Santa said, Warm up by doing lateral shuffles around the parameter in each direction. Then use the playground equipment to create several stations for cardio, core, and exercise for the upper and the lower body. For example, on a swing, I'd jump up and land in a wide stance, then do 10 scores. Mr. Santa had said, or you could lie across it and hold a Superman extension with the cactus arms, working your back, glutes, and the shoulders. Glutes. Be creative. If it's not too cold out, set up a race at the circuit in a park uh, or an open area. You might have challenge your child to ride a bike around a certain route while you do the crunches. Miss the bra uh, brilliant suggested and then you learn that route when your child returns, do a few laps of the circuit and try to <coughs> beat your best time. My kids will do anything if it's a race, she said. Cancer depends on the, on the menu. Research suggests consuming more than four or five servings of push products. Vegetables, cruciferous vegetables per week is associated with a reduced risk of cancer and other chronic conditions. On average, more than one in three per pe people in the United States will develop cancer at some point in their lifetime. According to the American Cancer Society, and many of those cases, they say, can potentially be prevented, including by making changes to your diet. <coughs> 
scientists have a good scientists have a good idea of when you should avoid to reduce the risk of cancer, such as red and processed meat. Red and processed meat, fast or processed food, alcohol and sugary drinks. But knowing what to eat isn't always straightforward, said the, uh, Johanna, a cancer prevention researcher at the Fred Hutchinson Cancer Center in Seattle. Many nutrition studies rely on people to accurately remember what they consumed uh, consumed up to a year ago, Dr. Lampe said, and it's tricky to understand how single food, just a part of a large diet, may influence your health, she said, adding that your lifestyle, environment, uh, hormones, and genes can also play a role. When coaching vision and star power collide, collide. We think that Kilian is one of the best players in the world, no doubt, no doubt. It would be like asking my daughter if she prepared my wife or me, he said, by way of explanation. A basic principle that remains valid. Don't keep your eggs in one, don't keep your eggs in one basket. Uh, diversify among stocks and buns. It isn't that. It's more important than ever. I'm talking about the 60 to 40 portfolio which had sometimes been considered the living heart of investing. Those specific numbers, which referred to 60% of the stock and 40% bonds as a core investing holding, aren't significant. They are merely a convenient starting point for thinking about investing and not an exact general purpose prescription for everyone, nor have ever been. The important issue isn't whether 60 to 40 portfolio mix is the best. It may not be, but all traditional balanced portfolios are mixtures of stocks and bonds seeking to lower risk through diversification and they are all open to the main complaint. Diversification didn't work well in 2022. A bigger uh, universe. In other words, go global. Use low-cost index funds or actively manage the funds, if that's your preference, that range across the whole planet. That's the approach I take and that academic finance generally recommend. Keep your cost low, invest broadly, and stick with it. It's a simple approach and a proven one, despite the painful lurches. Yeah, there, there are good reasons to uh, believe that it will work for years to come. <laughs> he straddled the African literature and uh, the politics.
or rock star looks to a connected future. This idea that the us would just be languages that everyone can speak in the future. I love this idea that the us would just be languages that everyone can speak in the future. Records for especially especially for the women. Fans gave their support, but reminders persisted of gains yet to be made. A few weeks later, the University of Iowa women's basketball team, led by Kaitlin, the reigning College of Women Athlete of the Year staged an outdoor preseason game in its football stadium, drawing a record 55,000 fans. What do they seek? Explorers, adventurers, scientists, men and women who always broadened the horizons for all humankind to share. Who can take a joke? Books review. Did you hear the one about cancel culture? Of course uh, you did, several times uh, over. If you've paid any attention to modern comedy and its purveyors, many of whom have grow roused about how hard it is to be funny in today's climate, but Two uh, new books shared an <coughs> exasperation with the common sentiment that there's never been a worse time to express oneself than the present. Taking them well seriously can liberate us from repeating the, the past. Inside the open AI's bitter leadership struggle, San Francisco, moved to oust <clears throat> Sam Altman reflected tension over the future of the technology. Around noon on November 17th, Sam Altman, the chief executive of OpenAI, logged into a video call from a luxury hotel in Las Vegas. He was in the city for his inaugural Formula I race, Formula One race, which had drawn 315,000 visitors including Rihanna and Kylie. Open AI's the aura of invulnerability has been shaken, said that Andrew, a Stanford professor who helped to found the AI labs at Google and the Chinese tech had a giant had a Baidu. From the moment it was created in 2015, OpenAI was primed 
to the combust, combust. The destruction of the company could be uh, consistent with the board's submission, fearing that if the Mr. and Altman got wind of uh, their plan, he would marshal his network against them. They acted quickly and the secretary. Turning the ta turning, turning the tables. Shortly after Mr. Altman's removal from OpenAI, a friend reached out uh, to him. It was Brian, a BNB chief executive. Mr. Altman now had two options negotiating a return to OpenAI on its terms or taking OpenAI's talent with him to Microsoft. The board stands form. By November 19th, Mr. Altman was so confident that he would be reappointed chief executive that he and his allies gave the board a deadline. Resign by 10 a.m. or everyone would leave. Mr. Altman went to OpenAI's office so he could be there when his return was announced. Mr. Hadabron Man also showed up with his wife, Hada Anna. <sighs> Last week, Mr. Altman and some of his advisors were still fuming. They wanted his name cleared. Do you have a plan? Do you have a plan B to stop the postulation about you being fired? It's not healthy and it's not true. Mr. Conway texted Mr. Altman. Mr. Altman said he was working with the open AI board. They really wanted silence. But I think important to address the soon. <sighs> to break the impasse, Mr. Hada D and Mr. Hada A uh, talked to the next day. Mr. Hadd suggested the former Treasury Secretary <sighs> The chaos raised a new question about the people and the companies behind the AI. Retirement to the age. Without a safety net. Immigrants, immigrant farm workers in U.S. keeps working. Most aren't eligible for the benefits. She pose on the if uh, digi spell slows her up balance, which she chokes up to high blood pressure. Something she learned about last year when a raging headache had prompted her to visit the doctor for the first time in recent memory. I feel tired, she said seated at a mobile home's kitchen table after a day's work. I feel like st stopping, but how can I? At 72, Ms. S is the oldest on a crew working in California's uh, Coachella Valley.
they were earning an average of twenty thousand dollars a year. Migration lodger seventy seven, and Teresa sixty six. We are old. We work. We had. We work anyway. The supervisor know know our work. Miss the F now sixty six is the illiterate. And the Mister R was only a little. They kept the going. Minnesota is considering new state to the new state to the flag to replace a cluttered genocidal mess. Ask the Minnesota Minnesotans about the state official flag, and prepare for the crush of the critics. Start with legibility. Uh, viewed from afar, it is difficult to make sense of the jumble of date, stars, and the state of the slogan in French, which rings the centerpiece of the images. Died young, most played American football. Only a few came close to reaching the pros. But like hundreds of deceased National Football League players, including the Pro Football Hall of Famers Mike Junior, So, and the Ken. They too had a CTE, CTE, the degenerative 
brain disease caused by repeated hits uh, to the head. For now, it can, it can be positively diagnosed only uh, post humorously. And they pondered a complicated question fraught with the imp uh, implications for uh, parents everywhere. If you could do it again, would you let your children, child, play tackle football? The answers that varied, which gets to the heart of a risk versus reward the dilemma. There is a line between the love of a game and the dangers it presents and even those that who have lost children cannot agree uh, where it is. But as we learn more about what contact the sports, contact, contact sports can do to the brain, it may be harder to justify letting children play. And in the United States, that is especially true for football, an American ritual. It is hard to imagine. It is hard to imagine their childhood without the football. This is America, and football is raised, is raised into its cultural soul. Lives, lives spin around the, the game. Afternoon practice, Friday night at the games, Saturday and the Sundays spent at the huddled around at the television. Start them young in tackle football. Book review or hunger for beauty and access sports. Out of our own assertion of our authority as an artist, Elkin, Elkin is scrupulous. <clears throat> About explaining the book's form purposefully undisciplined and anti-disciplinary. Her use of the fragment, it is the material from which we can rebuild even a choice of pronouns for an artist who use both she. When the essayist Lauren From Democratic Democratic governor's campaign tips for the Biden. Among officials advice, talk about the abortion, but don't talk about the Trump. Almost all of them are far more popular in their home state than the Democratic president 
they hope to re-elect the next year. While President Biden is mired in, in the political doldrums of low approval ratings and the national economy that voters are sour on the own. Democratic governors are riding high, having won re-election in Republican-leaning Kentucky last month and holding office in five of the seven most important presidential battleground state. Uh, we should talk about all the threat to women's uh, the health and uh, care, including abortion and the use that would specifically send to the Governor Gretchen of Michigan. We should be talking about it like that uh, because Americans are uh, the awake. They are angry that this right could be stripped away and we are the uh, only ones fighting for it. That had to be laid out in a much more crystal clear, explicit, affirmative way, he said. If I were in Biden's shoes, uh, I would not talk about Trump, she said. I would let other people talk about uh, the stump, uh, Trump. The people who are getting it doesn't really associate it with anybody other than finally being able, able to get health care for themselves, he said. The problem is going to be, it's going to take us 20 years to build all this uh, the infrastructure out. Mr. W said, whether they see it within the next 11 months or not, that's uh, the, what we needed to tell the story. Uh, if no one's showing up, doing stuff, I'm going to show up, he said. I can't take it. I can't take the alternative. I can't even conceive it.